A cold, damp morning in March 1981. Hunt, Taveri, Surtees, Agostini, Duke. The stars of motorsport gather to show their respect and grief for one of motorcycle racing's all-time legends, Mike Halewood. Bikers in their thousands surround the tiny church of St. Mary Magdalene at Tanworth in Arden to say a final farewell to their hero, tragically killed in a road accident along with daughter Michelle. How ironic that a man who had risked danger all his life should die in such sad circumstances and through no fault of his own. Just three years earlier, Mike, aged 39, had confirmed, if it was ever needed, that he would become a legend by performing one of the greatest comebacks of all time in the 1978 Isle of Man TT races, his 13th win. Mike summed up his feelings at the time. Well, through all the laps and every lap, every corner, they were all cheering and waving programs, and it was just fantastic. And going through one of the parts of the course, a place called Ramsey, which is very slow, I could actually hear the people cheering in the, by the side of the road, which was just amazing. To win a TT race at any time is an achievement. To win on a different machine after being away for some 11 years is almost unbelievable. But Mike was a man who believed. And that's what made the difference. He always liked a challenge. And the 37 and 3 quarter miles of twisting, tortuous bends and flat out straights must be the ultimate challenge. <laughs> 